Good morning! Hello, welcome back. Hang on, what do we have going on here? Hold up. There we go. Just fixing my iPad. Okay, hello, good morning. Welcome back to Dead Space. And what day is it? Tuesday, Tuesday morning. Hello, Psycho Ghost Rider. Hello, Chew. Hi, have you guys had your coffee yet? I am in the process of drinking mine. Mm. This is my second cup. Second cup of the day. All right. Let's get back into it. Let's get back into playing some Dead Space. Um, shit, I'm loving the fuck out of this game. I was talking about it last night at dinner. Uh, just how much I am enjoying. I'm enjoying this and I'm, I was enjoying the Callisto Protocol. Obviously, they, there's a lot of similarities. I didn't realize quite how many similarities there were. Um, but just in terms of the gameplay and the way you pick up items and the way you stomp on things, the weapons, the vibe, the look, the aesthetic. Lots of similarities, but it's all fucking good because, like, why not? I mean, it's, uh, it's a great game, so let's figure out where do we get up to. All right, so we left off. Ah, ha, ha. Spit. Entering zero gravity. So we got, oh, shit. Warning. Zero gravity, but no... Please attach generator modules manually. Oh shit. Oh my god, this room is huge. So we have, um... We have oxygen, which is good. Just seeing what I can pluck out of the air first. There's another box over there. Oh man. Oh, alright. Oxygen. Cool. What did we pick up? I wish, the only thing, I wish it would tell you what you picked up for like a little bit longer because I automatically hammer the X button, like X, 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 just to pick up, um, uh, pick up whatever's in there quickly and then I don't actually see what it was. You need to pause the second to read what you're picking up. And I don't do that. I just realized my chat is not showing up on the screen and the chat has been kind of weird on the iPad. Hang on, let me, uh, let me just check my settings. One second. One sec. I'm just gonna put it on the pause screen just for a Well, actually, no, never mind. Alright, that should work. Hey, Spornicus Rex. There's the chat working. I think. I think I may have just broken it, made it worse. Your audio and video are great. Awesome. Well, that's good to know. Okay. Oh, shit. This is fucking... Look at this. This is so cool. I'm just going to fly around for a minute. Uh, I don't think that's supposed to be like that. What's up with this dude's face? Oh, what's up with his face? Bro, where's your jaw? I'm, like missing his jaw or something? That is horrifying. Um, sorry to do this, bro, but like, oh, you can't punch in the air. I worry about the bodies being turned into necromorphs. Oh, look at that. So if I, my theory is if I stomp on them, then they, uh, they can't be turned into necromorphs. Did it again? Uh, I think that was the Ripper Blaze. Oh yeah, we have the Ripper! Fuck oh, yeah. Walk into my circular saw of death. Do I hear something? I hear enemies somewhere. In here. And here we have like an elevator. I'm not done with this main room yet though. 
definitely hear enemies. And I don't know where they are. Oh, there's one. where the elevator descended through. So I assume at some point we're going to re-engage the gravity but maybe lose the oxygen or something out of this room. Because I see the little ports to get oxygen. So we have elevators. I need that right now. I'm just looking for shit to pick up. That's something. Sometimes if you lose your sense of up, it's like easier just to land. And it will kind of like right to you. Or a little floating shiny thing. I kind of don't want to get in front of that. That looks kind of scary. Alright, where was our stasis recharge? It's O2. It's not that one. There's a stasis recharge somewhere. Over here? There it is. anything else to pick up. Hello, Goma Black Magic. Looks and sounds good here. Fuck yeah. Look at this. Look at this. This is fucking cool. Alright, let's figure out how to engage this. Can we, uh, So gonna suck all the oxygen out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We did something wrong. Guess you can't just stick it straight in. You gotta warm it up first. Uh okay. What do you want me to do? Ah, there's one down here as well. Can we do this one? be done in a certain order. No! That klaxon is, is very, uh... I feel like I'm being told off. It's like, no, you fuckhead! Don't be a moron! That guy can come. Can I land on this? I can't land on this. Sorry, dude. I gotta do this. Up is sometimes difficult. Going up. Here we go. Come 
There we go. No necromorphing for you. Um. Oh yeah, we had. We had options for doors. Where did I come in? Did I come in this way? Is this the way I came in? Yes. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna save it again. So we've got like all our pickups and all our bodies destroyed. Ah, uh, create new save. Yeah. Right. Let's figure this out. We have to somehow maybe destroy that thing. Attach clutch generator modules restart centrifuge. Okay, well we tried that and you went at me. So this elevator's not working. them are there. I think it's just those two we have to do. the centrifuge. Thank you for that. Helpful. Thing. Um, oh, I have an idea. Do we slow it down? There we go. Neat little puzzle. Did I hear an enemy come out from somewhere? Generator module attached. Clutch engaged. All personnel clear for Land. centrifuge restart. I hear enemies somewhere, but I don't know where they are. There. Figured it out. Hey, Obscured by Ink! Good morning! How's it going? Oh shit. Oh shit, we don't want to be standing in here, I don't think. Yep, there goes the oxygen. Georgia! Centrifuge activated. Re-establishing balance with tectonic load. Okay, now what do you want me to do? Oh, I can't take off anymore. Oh, shit. Now we have to go down, along, and up. I knew this was going to happen. There's going to be enemies. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left is restarting the engine. Oh, right? oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I didn't realize there wasn't a walkway there. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I d Who designed this thing? That's fucking bonkers. Alright. 
Who designed this? Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left do I have to get to? Engines, right? Ready when you are. Okay. I can do this. Go! Run! Quick like a bunny! Ooh! Go! Oh shit! Well, you can just get got. Oh fuck, run. Did I get him? Run! Shit! Oh shit! Oxygen! Eep! We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. We're gonna die! Ah! We're gonna die! Run! <laughs> This is cool. I like this bit. Alright, where's my oxygen? Not in here. Alright, where are we going? That way. Oh! Fuck me! So we don't have one up here? Okay. Shit! Oh shit! Did that actually injure me? I think it did. Fuck. Ooh. All right, that last bit I took that last hit. I thought we were above the centrifuge, and I guess we uh just put it. Oh, fuck me. Who the Oh, shit. Isaac, that that's you dead. Uh, can we reload? Maybe? Or something? Are we not- are we not gonna let me reload? Oh, there we go. Some Resident Evil shit right now. Come on! We can't reload for some reason. Oh, no. Oh, I think we died. He wouldn't reload! I could switch guns, but he wouldn't reload. Hey, Gary and John! Welcome in! Good morning! Uh, I just died. <laughs> let's have some help. And then, let's press the right button. Oh shit, am I actually out? <gasps> am I actually out of ammo? Are you serious? Oh no! I may have fucked up. I mean, we've got the uh, the Ripper blade. We'll we'll lead with that. See if that works. Let's give it a try. We may have to reload and only a save. Ouch. What am I aiming for? Come on, come on. Shit. Shit. There we go. I just needed to aim better. Holy fuck. Well, uh, let's go back and save it. <laughs> oh. Hey, Tux Trio! Hello, good morning. I've been quite trigger happy with my ammo because I seem to be picking up a fuck ton of it. I guess maybe I should have been a little more cautious. Hey, Doctor Respect! Am I feeling scared? Not scared, just like enjoying the the thrill of it. Like it's it's cool. Sometimes it does make me jump. I will say that. Um, but no, I'm loving it. It does it does make me scream on occasion when it when they startle me. Manually ignite the engines. Okay. Operations at risk. Caution. Engine operations at risk. Okay. 
I've been here, I've looted this place. Oh yeah, oh we're here, okay. blow up. Alright. I realized that I hadn't been paying attention to the fire extinguishers and they uh, can be used as a weapon. Yeah, I've gone the way. This, this is not the way. That's the way. inventory while we're waiting. What is this? Oh, schematics. Ripper blades. I guess I should switch to the Ripper because we've got a lot of ammo for that. Got it. Isaac, fuel storage is unlocked. It'll give you access to the engine chamber. Sweet. Alright, let's get some of my ammo out of storage because I stashed a few few things there. Okay, now we can purchase the med packs because we have and a ricochet tracer. I don't know what that is. Um, so we have a pulse rifle upgrade called the kinetic autoloader. Uh, extend the upgrade path and gain access to a special upgrade. All right. Um, oh, that's something we can buy. We have to buy that as an upgrade to load into the bench. So we own that. We have to go take that to a bench. It's a little complicated. Alright, let's just get some ammo out of storage. And then in my inventory, I have... Okay, sell that at the store, the semiconductor. Okay, sell that. And I feel like I'm pretty good with the oxygen, so I'm gonna I have one in my storage already. I'm gonna sell this one and I will keep the other one. And if we get to a point where it's like, oh, this bit's really hard, I need the oxygen, I can bring it back out of storage. Hey, Hubert, hello, good morning. Uh, let me see, what do we wanna buy? We could buy another node. Those are really fucking useful. We already have two, so we could buy one more. Or we could buy this upgrade for the Ripper, or an upgrade for the Pulse... Wait, I... It says... Oh no, owned zero. So I could buy this one. Honestly, I, I am liking the Pulse Rifle. Um... And we could buy an upgrade for the Plasma Cutter. Which... We're using a lot. So maybe I want to get that one. E I don't know. What do you guys think? Plasma cutter or pulse rifle? I'm enjoying both. Both are pretty well upgraded. Um, I don't know. Any preference? Does anyone have any thoughts on the matter? I'm leaning towards the pulse rifle. Because I think we can turn that into the more powerful weapon. But the plasma cutter is really useful at just like hacking off limbs and stuff like that. Pulse rifle is one of the best weapons. I am enjoying it. It's just how am I, uh, what am I using it for? I think because the pulse rifle is awesome for just killing, whereas the plasma cutter is awesome for strategic limb removal, <laughs> which makes me happy. It just makes me happy. I don't know. I don't know. Plasma cutter and force gun. Hmm. What is that? I 
exclamation point. Uh, let's go with let's go with the pulse rifle. We'll probably end up getting the other one as well. But for now, let's go with the pulse rifle. Where's the bench? Do we have a bench? bench. There's a bench here. Oh, there is no bench here. Well, shit. Maybe there's one in here. can strategically place mines with it. Like that. Like the sound of that. Is there anything in here? I'm like hunting for ammo and stuff now. Those screams don't sound very pleasant. It's really funny when he when he holds that up and I hear the sound the t -t 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 -t. I smell sawdust. It's like I can smell cutting things with a circular saw. Uh oh. It wants to go. That. Oh, did I come the wrong way? Cannot determine I clearance don't. level. Master security override required. All right, let's. Uh, pulse rifle upgrade graph extended. A new special ability is now accessible. Check it out. Oh fuck. So now we can increase the rate of fire. Oh, awesome. And it gives us all of this extra stuff to do. We have three nodes. We can do three lots of capacity or two lots and reload before we get to that. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? So the pulse rifle damage is 55. The plasma cutter damage is 110. It's extraordinarily high. And this is ammo capacity. Could be useful. Um, I think I'm gonna put what about the Ripper. The Ripper's damage is only 40, so we haven't upgraded that at all. So maybe we should upgrade this because it is pretty fucking cool. It's definitely a get the fuck out of my face weapon. Hey, Alexandru! Hello. Um. Let's see, let me see. Well, I think we go with the pulse rifle. Because we've put some into, we've put money into getting that upgrade, so we might as well fucking use that upgrade. Uh, so let's go. Gatsby. Gatsby. And if we go capacity again, then we can get that extra damage, which I would like, as well as getting that um, increased rate of fire. Because if we have <laughs> huge capacity, we don't really need the reload time to be particularly upgraded, not at the expense of spending our nodes. So next node we get, we'll be going in damage and great, uh, greatly increasing the rate of fire. Those will be the next two. Oh, wrong button. That's what I want to do. Alright. Hold on one second.
Uh, what is the fire rate of the pulse rifle? Good question. I didn't see. It says warning zero oxygen area. Warning zero gravity. I love the sign there. It's like the little person like flipping up. Oh, hello. Entering zero gravity. You will not be necromorphed. Oh shit, this does not look like a very work safe hey, kind of place. I cracked the secure files. DC was here for more than just a mining claim, huh? What do you mean? This outbreak started on the colony after the miners dug up some artifacts. Oh. Something alien. That's impossible. But it would explain why Aegis 7 is meant to be off limits, right? Earth Ghost orders. When the miners found the artifact, they reported hallucinations, paranoia, suicides. But the Ichimura brought this marker on board anyway. Like that was a plan. Wait. The marker. Okay, back up. Where's this marker now? In cargo. I'll pack it up for delivery. So basically, they found something on a planet that they weren't supposed to be on. And then uh, Wayland Yutani, I'm sorry, whatever company is in charge, decided to bring it back anyway. It's feeling very alien. fucking bodies flying around um let's see i see this red line don't tell me i have to go in there are you kidding me say airlock two fans let's turn off the fans let's turn on airlock two there we go. Oh shit. No, nap off. Not interested. Where is he? Who the fuck are you? I hear you. Where are you? There you are. Just drifting. Exiting zero gravity. Oh, I didn't do my stasis recharge. I should have done that. says it might be boring but the games i play always go for power and capacity yeah i mean that's uh that's a good strategy Entering 
can't imagine just like pushing past a bunch of bodies. Body parts floating in your face. Zero gravity. Oh shit. Okay guys, this is going to be really noisy, so let's turn the, uh, I don't want to, like, kill everyone's ears. Let's turn the sound effects down a little bit. There we go. And it's not quite as bad. Oh no! Is this guy going to... Should I... Should I kill him? <gasps> He's got a fucking flamethrower! Oh my god, yes fucking please! Holy shit, alright, it's on now, bitch! You don't give Claire Weaver a fucking flamethrower and expect it not to be on. Alright, let's equip this bad boy. Where is he? Equip! Yes, please! Oh, shit. So, project flames and then the firewall? Oh, that's like a get the fuck out of my face kind of situation. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, this is cool. Alright, alright, boy, are you gonna come to life or don't make me teach you a lesson? What is this poster? Fired up for work, but play with fire and get burned. Be careful when handling flamethrowers. Alright. Oh, this is... I would not. I'd... no. Ooh, I should probably be using the flamethrower. I feel like games give you a gun and then expect you to use it straight away. So let's uh... Oh, he doesn't like the lights! I think. Yeah. I mean, that dude can say that because he's got no legs. Okay, this is terrifying. I'm actually kind of scared. Engineering log. My last log. Temple reporting. I can't raise anyone on Riglink. I think my team is gone. I found the Kinesis module that someone used to bust the centrifuge. Burned out. Who would sabotage the Ishimura at a time like this? I'll report to the bridge. If anyone's left. Oh, sure. And then I'm finding cool. Elizabeth and getting us the hell off this ship. All right, bro, you do that. Um, let me see. Can we reload anything? We can use the small net pack. There we go. Oh, the lights came on. Lovely. It's 
see a fire extinguisher. All right, we'll go up there in a minute. Who wants this in the face? Anyone? There's another one. Uh-oh. There's lots of them. Uh-oh. Put this one back. <laughs> Flamethrower? Yes, please! Uh, grilled alien hives, says Alex. Let's say hi to you, Alex. I saw you pop in. Hello. Oh, shit, we're going down. I thought we were going up. I was disoriented. Alright, who wants some flames? Where are you? Oh. Oh shit! Oh shit! Fuck you! Fuck you! Yeah, you fucking asshole. Fucking... Oh, I'm kinda mad about that. What do we have in here? Bench? Anything else? Ooh. Yeah, some credits. And we did pick up a node, so now we can upgrade... Well, now I want to upgrade the flamethrower. Let's have a look. So, damage is 65, so that's good. Uh, duration 5 seconds, capacity 50. Reload time is a little slow. Let's see, we can increase the damage if we want to whatever it would be. 50... Uh, 75 maybe? I'm not sure how much it goes up by. Or oh, we can, because our pulse rifle is still lower than the flamethrower. We could increase the damage on this. I did say we were going to do that. So I think we do that. I think we commit to the pulse rifle. 60. Alright. Flamethrowers are fun, but they're not really as versatile. Like, long-term game... You know, I'm not going to be rocking the flamethrower all the way because they're so up close as well. Like, I don't, I don't need to be that up close. Thank you. This is not a melee game. Uh oh. Shit! I thought that would work. Ah, uh, I keep forgetting which weapon is on which part of the weapon wheel. Huh. Kill this bit first? What is... Oh shit, that was the wall of fire. Fuck. Wrong button. Well, that's kind of cool. I didn't mean to waste all my flamethrower ammo with that, but... This thing's not dying. Why oh, didn't just do that to begin with? Oh shit, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Ah, it's on me! Get it off me! What the fuck? That's what the flame throws. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up, we're running away. Bye. Fucking little shits. Oh no, it's on me again. Oh, get off me. Did it die? They die when they land on you. Oh no. I feel like I'm doing terrible with this part. Pick that up. What the fuck were they? Like tiny little frozen chickens. Let's 
check this room. Uh oh. Oh, yep, see, I knew it. I knew you were gonna do something fucking weird. I knew it. Stomp on the little chicken. I'm gonna stomp on you as well. Sorry. Sorry, human. I'm glad you weren't a necromorph, but like, this will stop you from changing into one. Clearance confirmed. Okay, so schematics for Ripper Blades. It'd be nice to pick that up, but then... Ah! Forgot what I was doing for a second. What do they come from? Oh, what the shit is that? What the shit? Ah, no! No! Get off me! Shit. anything out of these ones. Alright, where are we supposed- oh, we're supposed to be going through there. Okay, so we can check all these other doors first. For loot. None of which I'll be able to pick up. Fuck me. Alright, well... We need help. We can come back for this. Can we pick it up and take it with us? Can you un open this door, please? Okay. Let's see if we can just leave it here. We might get it on the way back. Oh shit, this does not does not look like a pleasant room. Hey. We pick that up? Oh there it is. Anything else in here besides monsters? Yeah, sorry dude. I'm just gonna leave you there. Don't care. Ooh, what the? Ah! I knew he was 
gonna stand up. I knew he was gonna stand up. Anyone else want to fuck with me? Anyone else? Warning. Come on. Planet fall imminent. Correct course immediately. Uh oh. Let's save it. Wouldn't it be so cool if you could have save points in real life? Ah, okay, I gotta say hi, I've been ignoring the chat, sorry, I was so into what I was doing. Hello to Hedgehog, and Someday Writer, and Boris Lav, and Lucky Kitty, and Captain Caffeine, holy cow, when did you guys sneak in? I was so into that bit, I was very absorbed in what we were doing. Um, chickens, yes, they are like little chickens. The music is spot on, says Obi, so creepy. Oh, Boris Lab, yes, thank you. Thank you for the congrats that I hit a thousand subs yesterday. Holy shit, I'm so fucking excited. This opens up so many possibilities for the channel. Um, YouTube has like a sort of gated system. I, I hit 500 midway through last year. Uh, that was a huge accomplishment. And now getting to a thousand. Holy shit, thank you, seriously, to every single one of my subscribers. Thank you. Um, YouTube will actually help you now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Boris has got to go. Just dropped in to like the video and give a congrats in person. Oh, well, thank you, Boris. And that is a good reminder. As Captain Caffeine says, smash that like button. Please do hit the like button. Um, if you're watching this after the live stream, if you're watching this later, please do leave a comment. It all helps the algorithm. Um, you know how these things work. If people interact with something, it's like, oh, this is valuable. More people will like it. So, uh, so yeah, I would appreciate those, those likes, those subscribes, those comments, all of that stuff. Even if you just comment flamethrower or something, like it doesn't have to make sense. Just any interaction does help. Um, let's see, Hedgehog says, I already played this game on my PS3, should buy it again on the PS5. This is really fucking good. Uh, I don't, I didn't play the original, so I don't know how it compares. But as a PS5 game, it is excellent. It is really fun. I mean, I'm assuming you you loved the first one, so I'm pretty going to say it was a pretty high degree of confidence that you'll love this one. Um, while we're paused here real quick, let's go through the links. Uh, let me just do this real quick. So the first one there, thank you, Spawnicus Rex, putting that in the chat. Buymeacoffee.com slash 8BitTerror. That is where you can go. If you enjoy this channel, if you like this channel, if you want to support this channel, help this channel grow. That's where you can do it. Buymeacoffee.com slash 8BitTerror. That is where you can make either a one-time contribution, throw a little money in the tip jar. It's greatly appreciated. It really helps. Uh, or you can become a channel member. Memberships are for awesome badasses only. Uh, so if you think you're an awesome badass, that's where you go. Uh, or if you want to be an awesome badass, that's what will make you an awesome badass is following that link and becoming a channel member. Uh, memberships start at a dollar a month. So it's just a way of supporting the channel with a monthly or an annual subscription. One dollar a month, that's $12 a year. That's really not a lot, um, but it means a lot to me. It really does help everything that I do. It helps with the games that I stream. It helps with the equipment that I use. It helps with the services that I pay for to make all this possible. I have monthly subscriptions to things for this channel, so it really helps with all that. And speaking of games, Callisto Protocol is a $70 game. Dead Space, $70 game. I'm gonna be doing Resident Evil 4, the remake. That's also gonna be a $70 game. Assassin's Creed Mirage, these games are fucking expensive. Um, you know, and then we've got Resident Evil 7, Resident Evil 8 that I've been streaming. Those were like 
30 or 40 dollars like it all adds up it's a lot of money to buy these games but i do it because i love it and it's made possible by the channel members seriously up until now this channel's not been monetized in fact this channel is still not monetized it takes a while to go through the youtube process so i'm not getting any money from youtube there's no money from youtube it all comes from buy me a coffee so if you want to become a channel member or if you just want to do a one-time contribution help support this channel that's how you do it buymeacoffee.com slash 8 i'll shut up about that but i do want to give a shout out to my channel members the awesome the incredible miranda satin basics of pain captain caffeine jay stabby obscured by ink Hani Okashe, Anton G, Tom Moose, James Guan, Boris Live 24 7, Neanderthal Bard, WD Henderson, Dogbone, Passionflower Percussion, Xylot DMB, Bex, Mike, Andy, Alexandru, Catherine the Great, Dandy Denny, Colorful Soldiers, CJ Voorhees, North Songs, and John Wagoner. Thank you guys, seriously, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, the other link, I oh, will do this one real quick. Uh, this is the merchandise. If you want to get a t-shirt, tank, a long sleeve tee, a sweater, a pin, a sticker, a mug, art print, tote bag, kid shirt, uh, whatever you might want to get, we have merch. Daysgonepodcast.threadless.com. There's Doom inspired merch. There's Days Gone inspired merch. There's the official Spawnicus Rex merch. Probably some more merch to come. I'm sure we'll do something with Dead Space. Um, or I think we're planning on a loot t-shirt so something that says like loot or whatever some cool design we'll get some stuff up there for that so yeah go check it out there's a lot of designs a lot of really cool stuff um lots of different ways you can have that design applied to physical products uh so go check it out and it ships internationally as well so wherever you are in the world you can get some awesome loot all right guys um hello dj dynamics i remember buying donkey kong country one and two it was like 50 dollars back in 95 please. <laughs> Rex just walked in and like slowly reached for my coffee cup. <laughs> All right. Uh, we saved. We saved. We did save. So what else do we have in this room? What is that? Oh, pistons or something. What is that? Looks like something I should be able to interact with. Oh, engine room. Warning, extreme heat. Well, fuck me. Hi, guys. Oh, shit! I can say that blew them up and it froze them in time, but I think there was a, um... Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit. Blow up if I shoot that. What happens? What are you doing? Weirdo. Oh shit! Oh, it's these things! Oh no! I wasn't paying attention! I wasn't paying attention! Okay. Fuck this. Fuck this. We're reloading. <laughs> We're reloading that. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy looking at the body of the thing that just blew up. I didn't see the little chickens. He's a little. Oh, she is a little chicken egg. She's a little pregnant. Zen what do we call them? Necromorphs, xenomorphs, whatever. And the little chicken. Okay, let's try that again. Uh... Give them a second to group up. We can do this the same shit when it will get the same. Are you dead? Yeah, there we go. Warning. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Yeah, I just burned your babies. Ah! Sorry, lady. Maybe you don't send your children out as child fucking soldiers next time. If you don't want to see them die. 
Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. That's bad parenting, right there. Giving birth and immediately sending your children into the face of enemy soldiers. Should have thought that through. <laughs> um, okay, let me catch up. Uh, Gary says, just wondering if anyone has ever had a Neo Geo. I have not. I vaguely, I've heard the term before, but I don't really know <laughs> what it is. Um, educate me. What is it? Tell me. Rex says, I reached for the coffee cup slowly because I know she's jumpy from playing this game. I didn't want to spook her. No, I'm not that jumpy. Uh, DJ says, this game looks really like uh, Metroid Prime. Failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Wait, your wife is at the hospital, DJ? Two weeks? Holy shit, what? I, I mean, don't share any more than you're comfortable with, but holy fuck, that's serious. I hope she's okay. I mean, obviously she's not if she's in the hospital, but like, I hope it's, um, I hope she's doing okay. Shit, that's really, uh, that's Warning. really tough. Engine power failure. Replace power Two weeks is a long ass sequence. time to be at the hospital. My ex was in the hospital for 11 days one time with a, an illness that he had. Has. It's like a genetic disease, so it's uh, one of those things that's never going to go away. But he's able to manage it now. Um... But yeah, that was that was terrifying. So we didn't know what it was at the time. Warning. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check downstairs first. Power yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh Replace god, this is gonna be a boss be battle in here, sequence. isn't it? You don't get all the shit without a boss battle. room does not fill me with joy. Warning. Engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Kinda don't want to begin ignition sequence. It sounds like it might be scary. So much stuff we all of a sudden can't pick up. All right, let's save it. Warning: engine power failure. Replace power cells. Yeah, let's figure out what's happening. Uh, day by day, she's getting a little better. Says DJ. Yeah, I, I hope that that trend continues and continues quickly. To begin ignition sequence. Ignition sequence initiated. Please stand by. I'm scared. Oh god. Oh, hello. What the- ah! 
Get away from me! Run! Idiot. Shit, missed it. Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! I don't have any stasis stuff left. Oh shit, I just got myself cornered. Not smart. Get him, get him. And you can stop spitting at me. Oh shit, I'm on fire a lot. Move, he won't run. He won't run. There we go. Oh my word, that hurt. I'm gonna stomp the living shit out of you. Holy cow. Oh, and there's more. All right, hang on. We're going to go back do that again. Neo Geo is a console you play arcades on. Arcade games cost about $200 or £200, and the games cost double that. Whoa. Ah, oh, wrong way. No. No. <laughs> yeah, the only thing I hate about the game, says OB, is the run mechanics. It's wonky and clunky. It's He kind of can't run sideways sometimes. Like, you, he can, but, like, it, pressing the button is a little... Um, doesn't always respond, and he's slow to get started. It's like, come on, dude. It's not that fucking hard. Ignition sequence initiated. Please stand by. Oh shit! You went all in for that. Fuck me! Fuck! Run! Fuel outlets secure. Please stand by. Skydive. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Alright, you can fuck off first. Nah, off. Oh. Shit, I'm getting my ass kicked. Run, Isaac! For the love of God, why is he not running? Did I get hit with that stuff again? I think I did. Ah, oh, it's so hard when you get out of the stasis stuff. Don't you spit at me. Don't you spit at me. Please fucking die. Oh shit, it's so good. Right. Finalizing pre-ignition checks. Stand clear of exhaust. Spitty dude. Holy shit. Engines ready. Please confirm ignition order. No. I'm stomping. I'll confirm ignition order in a minute when I'm done stomping on these assholes. Let me stomp in peace. There we go. Give me that. Oh, there's one of these here that I miss. <sighs> C 
Seriously, is that all the pickups? All it's going to give me? Engines ready. Please confirm oh, ignition my. order. There we go. I need to be more. Oh, shit. Engines ready. Oh, I can't Please go and save it. Order. Damn it. Gonna let me out. Shit, I, this does not seem like a place Osha would want you to be. Isaac, you did it. The Ishimura's moving again. No thanks to whoever Hey, Jeb, as with us. You bought us time to and figure I it out. Fresh coffee. Thank you, right? Geostationary orbit. Wait, you're flying us through the planet crack debris? That's what the asteroid defense system is for. But the ADS is offline. Hmm. I've got the system readouts here. Hammond, the Jeremy, rough Isaac could totally fit in a couple of at a, a hoedown with that stomping of his. Daniels, give me all the data you have. I'll try to adjust course. Isaac, you disable the tram lockdown from engineering. I'll open up the bridge station. Meet me there. We need to work on this together. All right, just let me save it. I could have saved it by now if you'd stop talking. Hey, KB Slayer! How's it going? Uh, I am doing good, thank you. I've had, I'm on my third coffee of the day. So I'm well caffeinated. And, uh... Yeah, enjoying this game. We've got a flamethrower. Now hold on, where is this going to take us? Because we left things to pick up in the other room. Yeah, we need to go back. We need to go back to the future. No, back to the other room. Assuming it will let us. Oh, can I recharge my stasis here? Was there not? Oh shit, I don't think I can get through. Fuck, I don't have stasis. Should I risk it? Should I risk it? I mean, fuck it, we just saved it. Oh, I lost my arm. No, I can't get through. You, can't, you just can't get through it. <laughs> my head just fell off. What? Hold on one second. Hang on, one sec. Sorry about that, everyone. We, uh, we've been hearing weird noises in the house recently. Um, Rex has gone to investigate. It may be... It may be necromorphs. Maybe ghosts. We'll find out. Um, grab your necromorph. do -si do Stomp around and kill that hoe. <laughs> I like that. Catherine Jones and Ben Holt. Tries once, arm falls off. Hmm, let's try again. <laughs> And hello to Remington, Canada. Hello, welcome in. All right, let's not run headlong into a uh, into a smashy door. I am disappointed that we left those uh, schematics and things behind. We might be able to go back and get them. 
Hopefully. Oh shit, it's gone. Oh fuck me! Oh fuck! Wasn't expecting that. No, you suck up the flamethrower out! Oh damn it. Would you fucking shoot me with that shit? Oh. I was ill prepared for the fight. Long live gaming! Um. Wait. Why is it not reloaded? The game's gone weird. I'm just... I'm a ghost! I'm a ghost, it hasn't reloaded us. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. Um, Rex, what was the noise? Oh, it might have been in the game, maybe. He has an earbud in. Uh, so far, which is better? Dead Space or Callisto Protocol? <gasps> ah, good question. They're both excellent. Um, honestly, I think Dead Space is a little more fun. A little more gleeful, you know, shoot things and... Uh, it's a little less restrictive as well in terms of where you can go, backtracking and stuff. The levels are a bit bigger. Uh, it feels... Honestly, I don't want to say it feels like more of a game. But I really fucking enjoyed the vibe of Callisto. And... I don't know. I, I think I enjoyed the setting and, and all of that of Callisto more than this. Nicole? So who do we have in there? Come on. What happened to the enemies? They were, we just got our asses kicked. Here. Did we not? Did we not just get our ass kicked? Obi says, I agree with you 8-bit. Dead Space is definitely more fun, but Callisto wins in the visuals and graphics, in my opinion. And the sound, the sound design in this is good, but the sound design in Callisto is phenomenal. It's excellent. Like, I want to make ASMR videos of Callisto Protocol because it's just that good. I spent five minutes the other day with the headphones on, just standing in a room in the Callisto Protocol, just listening to it. So fucking cool. Whereas this is like, it's good, but it's nothing groundbreaking. Where are these enemies that were supposed to come out? I'm like, really scared now. Let's do our thing at the store. Let's see. Hey, we can now buy a flame throw of fuel and jellified hydrazine. What the shit is that? Let's have a look. Bring this part to the bench to extend the upgrade path and gain access to a special upgrade. Ooh. I'm curious, but we will probably not be getting that just because I'm not going to be using the flamethrower all that much. As fun as it is. Um... <laughs> Don't have much in the way of pulse rifle ammo. Um. I really want to recharge my stasis blasty thing. Where can we do that? Is that it? That might be one. Uh. Yeah, stasis. We can't get in there because the door's locked. Fuck.
this way. Wait. Can get in here. Can we not? We can get in here. Said it was locked on the map. Oh, hello, Torso. Entering zero gravity. Can you land, please, sir? Let's see if we can go back this way and get our um, pickups and stuff that we left behind. If we run into enemies, we Exiting will zero it. We get down there. Oh, it's over here. I think did I leave something in this room as well? I feel like maybe I did. No. Maybe not. I hope all our stuff is still there. Ratchet and Clank. I have not played that. I feel like you asked me all these, like, have you played this, have you played that? And I'm always like, no, sorry. Uh, ben Holt says, I played Dead Space for, I think, 10 minutes. When the light shut off, I paused the game and flung the controls to my brother and screamed, your turn. I'm not fucking with that. <laughs> uh, Rex says, Callisto has Sam Witwer and it's a great, great, great game where Dead Space is just a great game. <laughs> That's a good way of putting it. Uh, the devs of Dead Space might be pleased to hear that. Give each other high fives and shit. Uh, does Callisto have zero G? It does not. I am really enjoying the zero G. Like, really enjoying it. It's really fun. Uh, ben says, I cannot really compare the two. Playing Callisto and watching my brother play Dead Space was a blast. Really brought the two of us together. Oh, I love that about video games, how they bring people together. Uh, Jeremy says, I did when it was a free game of the month. I also played it uh, back in the day on PS2 when I was traveling for work. And Obi, yeah, anything with Sam is gold. Ahaha, a bench. That makes me nervous. Do we have any nodes? I... we do. Okay. Mm. Oh, we said we were going to get this special. Uh, increase the rate of fire. So I can burn through the ammo quicker. I mean, it says it's a kinetic autoloader. So does that mean we don't have to reload? I don't know. We'll find out. Or it's, no, no, it, it makes the bullets go in faster or something. You gun people know what I'm talking about. I swear I left something behind on one of these levels. Here it is. Ripper blade schematics and... Hey, they stayed where we left them. Stasis pack. And gold semi. Oh, that's worth money! Well, we can heal. And now we can pick it up. Hey, yeah. Uh, uh, easiest way, quickest way is through here. Alright. Save it again. That was worth it. That was worth the little detour. Some fucking awesome stuff. 
I bet when we go back into the main room now, though, that the, uh, those enemies are there. I love this above the door. Days without incident. Error. <laughs> oh, shit, why is it so dark? They, why are they not here? It must have been that weird little glitch we had. It must have erased the enemies. I'll take it. <laughs> Days with that instant error. Oh, hold up. Can't create more save data for this game or app. What? Why? There's insufficient space when trying to save the current game. Um. Bullshit. But yeah, bullshit. I have like an internal. Check your storage. All right. Uh, pause for figuring this out. I'm just gonna put up the pause screen for a minute. <clears throat> Take an intermission. Go get yourself coffee. Let me figure this out. I'll be right back. I want to share this with everyone. Look at this. Look at this. How much uh, space I have. Free space. Oh, you can't see it because my camera's in the way. Well, anyway, it says free space, 957.5 gigabytes. And console storage is 263.8 gigabytes available. It may so, simply mean that the game isn't allowing you to create a new slot. Right. It could be in the game. Yes, just the game can only have so many slots. But why would it give you an empty save slot option? Say no, you can't do it, yeah. Let's overwrite this. Sure. Okay, cool. Well, we got that figured out. Weird. Why give you that option if you don't not gonna let people use that option? Anyway. Um <laughs> yeah, days without instant error. And yeah, con uh, console is not very travel friendly. Um, but Jeremy, you took yours all over the place playing uh, Assassin's Creed, Red Dead, Zombies in Mexico, some Tales of series, even even the bouncer. I don't know that one. Yeah, that was weird. It was very weird. Okay, where are we going? And, oh, we need to go back to the store and upload those schematics that we just picked up. Let's do that. Ripper blades, and was that it? I thought there was another one. Oh, we got a thing to sell, didn't we? Oh, shit. That was worth a fuck ton. Alright. Fuck it, not saving it again. <laughs> We finish chapter three. Obliteration imminent. This is the name of chapter four. Holy shit. Okay, so we need to get to the bridge. Bridge. There we go. Bridge. 
12-hour shifts, seven days a week for months at a time. Holy shit. Does this game have infinite ammo, says KB? Uh, not currently. Maybe when you, uh, I don't know if when you finish it, if there's like a, a cheat or a reward or something, but no, it, it does not. I don't think it would. Uh, even on like a little, now arriving at the bridge. um, without like a cheat code or something. Now, ammo is definitely a resource that we have to manage. <laughs> Isaac, I'm looking at the ADS cannons. They're a mess. I'm gonna need your help. I am not losing the Ishimura. Not now. The Ishimura, Hammond, or the marker? That artifact they found? Don't bullshit us. CEC knew all along about the marker, didn't they? Isn't that why you're really here? Corporate would have yeah, said the Ishimura but, for some I mean, books, Hammond. Money. But alien technology, yeah, that fits. And how does losing my team fit into this theory? Hey, knock this shit off. We're into the debris field. We get the ADS back together, or it's over. Then meet me at the captain's nest. Daniels? Fine. But I'm going through the ship reports, Hammond. I'm getting some answers. Fuck yeah, Daniels. Oh, hi. Oh, uh, where the crap are we going? That way. Alright, let's check over here, see what we got. Nothing. Alright. And save. Can we? Now it's- no, it's not gonna let us. Alright, well that's fine. Can you, uh... Okay, that's fine. Let me just pick a different one. Jeremy says, uh, long shifts, they, they were indeed. Good money and trade-off was months of time off. Months at a time off. And then months at a time working your fucking ass off. That's got it. That has to suck. Like, good payoff, I guess, but that's gotta suck. Captain Nest Crow's Quarters? What kind of space aeronautical bullshit labeling system is this? I didn't see that. Where was that? That was back here. Crew deck. Main atrium. Did you guys say that was spring? Am I allowed to walk past? Are you done? Are you gonna come back? Let's run. I feel like I'm carrying too much stuff. I don't want to put any of it down. Uh-oh. Tomorrow is a good idea. <laughs> if we live that long. Oh shit. I mean to stomp on one of these. God oh, damn it. I didn't do that. That wasn't me. You okay? At 
least containment and life support are holding. So far. For now. I walk into a place, I'm like, don't do anything just yet. I need to loot this room. This is a big room. Let me loot it all. Let me stomp on some shit. I've stomped on everything. Uh-oh, why do we have a save point right here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, hold up, hold up. Let me catch up. Obi says, I just bought a badass PS5 travel backpack for my son because he'll be leaving for Texas in two weeks. It's pretty nice. Oh, where is he? Why is he going to Texas? Where in Texas? Uh, he got a job with the railroad, so he's got to go to Texas for training. Oh. Jeremy says, I needed a job at 17 that paid real money and wasn't coordinated enough for exotic dancer <laughs> and too tall for pilot. And what? <laughs> that too old for the clutch. Oh my god, Jeremy. You are so funny. I'm guessing we're going this way. This feels like end of game and stuff, but I know it's not. I know we're a third of the way through. Uh, this isn't a particularly huge game, but it's not a small short game. Hey! Sorry. Shit, you scared me. No, no. Keep that rifle close. What is that? The one that attacked me. I managed to trap him here. Oh, you trapped him. You trapped him, did you? Uh-huh. His face. I'm not seeing things, right? That's Chen. You can't help him, Hammond. He's... You're right. I should... Oops. The hell with it. Oh, he's gonna... Gonna flush him? Escape pod 47 launched. I work with him. Escape pod? No! No, no, wait, 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 no, 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 you don't launch a monster in an escape pod because that thing's going to have a beacon and someone else is going to come along and be like, oh no, an escape pod, let me save this person and then you're going to kill everyone. And I know that I'm sure the, you know, overlords or whatever, whoever we're working for, whoever Hammond is working for, is going to scoop it up and study it and turn it into a weapon or whatever, but like, no. We're gonna fix this, Hammond. For them. Yeah. How is how is Isaac so fucking dumb that he doesn't see what just happened? I can hold this how position for a not... while. No more asteroids come through. The and we're one escape pod short now. We're gonna need that later. In fact, I don't know if any of these are still good. Come on, Earth, Hammond. Could you be any more obvious? All I can tell is the ADS power route was shot. Well, the administration systems aren't doing much. We could redirect power from there. I'd need to rewire the junction boxes, but we get the ADS cannons back. Good. Look how nerdy our guy looks. I really expected more of someone who dresses like the Doom Slayer. Isaac, about what Daniel said. I don't know about any illegal mining or the marker. I swear, I'm just here for a repair mission. Look, Hammond. I don't know you or Daniels well enough to judge, but CEC had to know about the marker. The company did, but shit like that's above my pay grade. Look, mm -hmm. we can get into it later. You'll need a way down to those junction boxes. You can turn the atrium elevators back on from security. You'll have full access. I found a CEC executive key card. I'll upgrade your clearance. And you OB, your already? kiddo's going to Amarillo, yeah. Texas? Just in case. And Isaac, I heard something up there. Something uh -oh. big. 
Watch your back. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, Cat says, don't worry, Claire, it will be dead before it gets anywhere. No food for aliens. I assume they have some sort of stasis thing in the escape pods, because it would take a long time for you to be rescued from anywhere in space. So that thing is going to live until it's rescued, for sure. Also, they're necromorphs. They're already dead. I don't, I don't think he needs to eat. Hammond just royally fucked somebody. <laughs> I'm not sure who. All right, guys, I think this is a good place to stop it for today. We will come back tomorrow and uh, continue our mission to save the Ishimura or escape the Ishimura and not get killed. Um, <laughs> even though we know it's going to happen a few times. All right, I want to say thank you to everyone who has uh, hung out with me this morning. Thank you, everyone, for being here. Thank you to everyone who's watching this later. If you're watching this not live, I appreciate you guys too. Please do hit like and subscribe if you're not already subscribed leave a comment um and uh i will be back with this tomorrow morning at 8 a.m mountain so usual time we'll be back tomorrow tonight on the spawnicus rex channel so it is tuesday that means it is assassin's creed valhalla day um that will be tonight over on the spawnicus rex channel at 7 p.m mountain uh anything else before i go Make sure to play Amarillo by morning when the kiddo is traveling, says Jeb. <laughs> All right, and there's the link. Thank you, Rex. There's the link for Buy Me a Coffee if anyone wants to contribute. Buymeacoffee.com slash 8 bitterror Merch is at daysgonepodcast.threadless.com. Um, and we also have a Discord. Uh, I assume the link is probably about to drop in the chat. So if you want to come hang out on the Discord, uh, there will be the link as well. All right, guys. Thank you all for being here. Have a great day. I will see you tomorrow. And as always... Stay safe out there. Bye, guys. <laughs>